A Marcos Diniz, a high school graduate, back on the field tonight after suffering a life alerting injury in a car crash in January. Yeah, she has certainly defied the odds, and she's now the kicking coach on the football team. Fox 10's Irene Snyder live from the game tonight. Irene, this was life altering. Kristen and John, uh, sorry, Christina and John, this definitely was a life altering injury and was very inspiring story. Kristen graduated from high school here in 2017. During that time, she played several different sports. She ran track, she played volleyball, and she was also on the varsity football team. Now, after that injury in January of this year, she says that she really, doctors told her she would never walk again, that she'd never be able to play sports again. But Kristen says she always knew that she was going to walk again. Gearing up for the 2021 football season at Marcos Deniza High School. Players, cheerleaders, band members, and coaches are all set. The newest coach on staff is Kristen Muir. I'm feeling really excited. Um, it feels really good to be back on the field with the guys. Walking out on the field tonight for the first time in four years is an extra special feat for her. Considering that just a few months ago, doctors told her she may never walk again. In January, Kristen and her boyfriend were in a car accident. Kristen suffered a broken vertebrae and a damaged spinal cord. She was paralyzed from the waist down. But throughout it all, she never lost hope. Once they told me, I really had no other option in my mind that I wasn't going to walk. I already knew that I was. Um, so it was just the fact of getting there and putting in that hard work. The Padres' first home game tonight was dedicated to Kristen. She started this game off strong with the coin toss. Heads. Heads is called. Let's take a look. We have hit. Oh, yeah, it's good. I was nervous because he said if I dropped it, then we have to restart. And I was like, oh, no. So, but I caught it on the first try, so we're good. The highlight of the night for Kristen, the people, all those who showed up rocking her favorite color red, and those who she says have been there supporting her through it all. They are like family. The fact that they've came together and supported me, like, through this whole entire journey, um, it just makes me really grateful, and I feel really blessed for it. Moving forward, Kristen says her goal is to inspire others that no matter what battle they may be facing, to never give up. Stay as positive as you can, be motivated, try and see, try and find things that inspire you, and just keep pushing. And Kristen says she has some other pretty big aspirations, goals aside from coaching. She also wants to write a book and again, just keep inspiring people to never give up on their dreams, their goals, no matter how hard the obstacles in their lives may be. So definitely a very inspiring story from Kristen here today. Reporting live in Tempe, I'm Irene Snyder for Fox 10 News.